Skulls and minions, it is me, Noir Proxy, and as you can see, you're gonna jump into Lightning Returns Final Fantasy 13. Wow, that is a mouthful, but still, I'm kind of intrigued to jump into this game. Let's just go into the settings quickly. Now, originally, I did buy Final Fantasy 13, and it was boring, and I'm really sorry if there are any massive Final Fantasy 13 fans out there, but I just could not get into the game. I hated the characters, the story took on, it just went on forever and ever, and nothing was happening. The characters were unlikable. I hated the main character, Lightning, but in this game, Game, they seem to maybe learn from their mistakes. I never played part two, sadly. It, I don't know, there's that character with Aladdin pants? That was the only reason why I didn't play it, because the character with the Aladdin pants. I was like, I don't want to play as a dude with Aladdin pants. <laughs> it's a really horrible reason. Let's make sure that the, yeah, it seems that all the subtitles are on, which is excellente. Now, as I said, not a massive fan of Final Fantasy 13, but it seems that in this one, they may have gone for a bit of a darker tone, which is excellent. As you know, Final Fantasy is amazing when they go for the more darker, like, settings and stuff. Okay, if you think about, like, like Final Fantasy 7 with Sephiroth, or more with, like, um, Final Fantasy 8 in general, which is a really dark game. And so, I like it when they do these types of games. So, Final Fantasy 13 Lightning Returns actually looks a little bit more interesting. What's also quite cool, it's more based on a singular character, kind of like Crisis Core on the PSP. I played that game, I really liked it, and so I'm very intrigued, as I said, to play this version. So, it's going to be really, really cool. So, anyway, Lightning Returns Final Fantasy 13, here we go. Oh wait, got to pick a chapter. Okay, so what's this all about? Primer, Outer World Services. You can use various networking features in this game to communicate with other players. Okay, so it's kind of got like a social networking kind of thing to it. As long as you are connected to the internet, or oh, good thing that it's, the internet's all about everything these days, the online environment that is available with via your connection is called the Outer World. And the ways that you can communicate with other players is in the space of the Outer World services. You can post about your experiences in the game and view screenshots. So it's kind of got like a bit of a Dark Souls, Demon Souls kind of thing going on with it then. So you can like post like hints and warnings maybe too. That's kind of cool. What's all this about? Outer World services again. People whose names appear in blue in the field are carrying messages. Oh, okay. All oh, right, so the NPCs actually hold messages from other players. Ah, that's kind of, it's kind of interesting. Don't you think it means? What do you think to that? It's kind of cool. We'll see what it's like. Okay, onwards we go. Do you want to enable connections to the Outer World services? I guess so. Always worth to try everything, minions. Okay, so we got a bunch of rubbish here. Let's just skip all that shizzle and then press X. I agree. Can we play the game now? <laughs> oh, great. Here we go. Oh, finally, it's loading. Awesome. Excitement. Do you remember those times when, I don't know, when everyone thought that maybe loading screens would have ended by now? It's, they're still here, minions. And they're still thriving, it seems. When I awoke... From my dreamless sleep, I was just in time to witness the end of the world. Fire! 
Snow. That's been a long time. You know what I am. And you know what I want. I can take a wild guess. You want to save me. The legends had told of her coming. Banisher of darkness. Bringer of light. Redeemer of souls. She'd come at the end of days to guide our souls to salvation. Damn you, Lightning! What's it gonna be? You gonna try to kill me? Huh? <laughs> It's over. You're a regular angel of death, Light. So now what? This the bit where you save my soul? I could help you, if that's what you want. Damn it! What kind of answer is that? <laughs> uh-uh. Now that isn't going to work. <laughs> Lumina! Now that's not right. You're not supposed to throw your life away. <laughs> uh! I swear that kid is a demon. Angels of death and demons? You're attracting the wrong crowd, Snow. Oh. No one is gonna stop me. You hear? Not you, definitely not her. If I have to fight the savior, then I will. confusing, I have to admit. As I said, I haven't played the second game, so I have no freaking clue what's going on. The centuries have changed us, Snow and me. Once we fought desperately together against our fates. Now he's patron of a never-ending revel, presiding over a banquet at the end of the world. And I've become the savior. I'm a servant of God, sent to a world being consumed by chaos. Tell me, Snow. Has ever a day passed when you haven't thought about Sarah? The girl you loved? My younger sister? How long has she been gone now? She brought us together and made us allies and friends. I can't give her back to you, but I can save your soul and free you from your long torment. It'll be my first act as savior. Mr. Hope has time. Any ideas? What do I do next? Blake, come on. Just call me Hope, okay? Right now, your number one priority is Snow. Don't let him get away. Oh, great. Hope's in this again. <laughs> I hated Hope as a character. He was so an emo. Okay, what have we got here? The schemata to... Oh, jeez. Okay. A new, a new kind of system. Do we want to take the tutorial? I assume so. Now, as I was saying, I do not know what's been going on with Final Fantasy XIII. I never played Part Two, but it seems that maybe Lightning has become some kind of Grim Reaper, <laughs> which is kind of cool if you think about it. Don't you think that's kind of awesome? It seems that they may have changed the battle system a little bit too. As you know, in the original ones, it was all about just letting the game auto do everything for you, and not many people liked that. But this one's kind of like Final Fantasy X X2. I think that's what it's called, or Final Fantasy X. I, I don't know. It's all Roman numerals and all that kind of stuff. But it all it was all to do with costumes and things. In this one, it's got to do with costumes again. 
again. So you can like change your costumes, you can do like mage roll, warrior roll, and other med uh, medic. I don't know. I We're gonna learn minions. Let's take the little tutorial and see what happens. Right! Move lightning with the left stick. Okay, so it is kind of like Crisis Core then. And attack using the abilities assigned to each button. Okay. Eat with the press the button of each ability you wish to unleash. Each ability will consume a set of AT oh, right, so the ATB bar is back in this game again. Okay, so basically when you use that ATB bar, it kind of um, that's what uh, that's our currency for using abilities. When you run out of it, you need to let like, it recharge, I think. Hold down circle to attack. Wait, wait, what? Hold down circle attack to strike out your enemy until you are out of AT. Okay, that's a bit randomly worded. Okay. So circle. Oh, there we go. Our normal attacks. Okay, fun. And if I press X. Oh, look! Okay, it's like a surrounding attack. We've got guard button. Okay, but that uses ATB too, so you need to use it at the right time and do it tactically. Lightning can switch between the three schematas in battle, each with different abilities and strengths. Press L1 and R1 to change schemata. Okay. Oh, there we- Oh, cool! We're like a commando skin. Don't know about our outfits. They're a little bit scantily, <laughs> which is a little bit weird. Okay, it's a Japanese game, though, so I guess that kind of makes sense. Schema, schema. Skilimida is used to describe a given set of garb equipment and abilities. Each skilimida has its own ATB gorge, which is represented over time. Oh, replenish, I say, sorry. I've got my words wrong there, it seems. Okay, cool. Keep your eye on the ATB gorges and enemies' health and switch between skilimida to match the situation. Use your skilimida to wisely defeat even the strongest opponents. Okay, cool. Interesting. Right, so what does this one do? Oh, it's rushing in there, it seems. Okay, just normal attacks. But she can do frost strike with this one. Which does? Ah, okay, so it's more like a melee frost attack. Don't know about that costume, that's called the Dark Muse. What's this one called? Oh, look, she's got a little mage hat and everything, it's so cute. Okay, so let's use Blazagger on it. There we go. Cool. So once when you run out of all your ATB... Oh, wait, it's, it's recharging slowly over time, I see. Rapid Fire. Oh, okay, so if you're using the Black Mage, you can do kind of like ranged attacks. God! There we go. Awesome. I get you. Yeah, I get what you do with this game. Okay, let's go back to this savior. And pwn it in the face. <laughs> and then, thunder. Oh, a little spark. That's so cute. Okay, so it's kind of cool, actually. I'm kind of liking this, how you can like move around freely and stuff. Can't run, which is kind of unusual. Hi there, friend. You're going to try and smack me or should I smack you? Okay, here we go. Better spend some justice on it before it kills me. And victory. Okay, so your soul is mine, right? <laughs> awesome. So, why was... Okay, so I have barely any ATB left, which is kind of a shame. So does that actually replenish into the next fight? I hope so. Okay, what happens next? The loading screen. Exciting. Awesome. I love loading screens. Okay, so we've got six days left until the end of the world. The door should open once the area is deemed safe. Yeah, they're chasing me! I guess that means clearing out all the monsters, right? Okay! Pre attack enemies using R1. Strike preemptively for an advantage. I see, okay. R1. Ah, oh, there we go. Enemy begins with 10% less HP. Oh, cool! Okay, preemptive strikes like that, then. Oh, it's like a floating bunny rabbit demon called a Nibblet! That's so cute! Wanna take it home and maybe make it into a keychain and sell it? And smack it one more- Ooh! Guard! Guard! Okay, I didn't guard for some reason. So, why didn't I be able to- It's because I used all my ATB- Ah, I see. Okay, so you need your ATB to guard as well. Okay, let's finish off with a thunder. And it's out of there. Ooh, it opened up and stuff. That's kind of gross. Victory! Why did she keep touching her little necklace thing? That's kind of unusual. Is that where she's like taking in the soul of the enemies, maybe? I don't know, minions. We'll hopefully find out. Okay, moving onwards. Who should I fight next? Should I fight the Anubis? Or should I fight the Bunny Yip? <laughs> the Nibblet? Okay, going for attack. Oh, quick! Ooh, that was close. Okay, hit me too. Does that actually make any difference? Mmm, seems that like my health doesn't replenish. Okay, guarding tutorial. Here we go. Would I like to learn about the guarding tutorial against enemy attacks? Yes. Right. Hold down square to use guard. An offensive ability that lessens the damage you take from attacks. Hold down square to train guard against an enemy incoming attack. Okay, cool. And block. Does that slowly lower the ATB the longer that you hold it, though? You guard it against an attack. Obviously, stay in the Pacific there, buddy. Whatever you are, AI. When an enemy is about to attack, don't forget to use guard to minimize damage and HP loss. But obviously, you need your ATB to use that. But how much does it cost? It doesn't really tell you how much each thing costs, though. It's a bit weird. Okay. 
To recover HP, press start and use a recovery... Oh, really? You have to go into the press start button? Okay. When HP reaches zero, you can no longer fight. Be sure to recover HP before it is too late. Lightning does not heal automatically after a fight. Oh, dear. Outside of a battle, press triangle to open the menu. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, we know all this. Okay, awesome. Right, let's put it in the face. Yeah. So, really... Oh, look, a combo! Okay, you can use combos in this game. Should be a bit of a thunder attack there. Want to save our ATB, though, for the guard, just in case it tries to attack us, too. Need to recharge my AT a little bit, though. And it's going for attack there, minions! There we go, block. It seems that holding it down does lessen the ATB the longer you hold it, though, so need to remember that. Seems there's an invisible wall outside the battle arena, which is kind of weird. Blocking! Uh, quick! Okay, a bit of a slow attack there, buddy. I need some more ATB. <laughs> it seems I'm exhausted. Which sucks. What if I change to a different one, though? Oh, here we go. Okay, so you can actually mix and match your different ones. Oh, baby block! Okay, I press L1 by accident there. I'm really, really sorry. Okay, dark news. Time to do some ponage. Yeah, yeah. And can I do a combo? Seems not. I am out of ATB again. Go for the block. There we go. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. Going for a rapid strike now, minions. Here we go. Dark mage, don't let me down. Quick freeze. And then I could go into this one and smack it around the block. There we go. Okay, I thought maybe the quick freeze might actually slow it down and I could do like a combo into the savior one. Do you know what I mean? I'm trying to do like a freeze them, slow them down, and then go in for some like proper comboage with my savior ability. It seems not. Okay, moving onwards. So I pwned all the enemies, right? Seems so. So where are we going next? What is my next objective? Attack more enemies. Ooh, look. Red. What's that about? So this person has a message for me, maybe. Let's go talk to them. Hi there, waitress. Check. Okay. Oh, I can buy I can buy a scent item. What's this about? It's downloading something, minions. I'm slightly excited. I got loads of money. 51,350 gil and four out of six recovery items. Okay. It's downloading something and it won't let me continue without it down. Uh, what's this? A screenshot. So someone took a screenshot and sent me it. Someone called Red. Okay. Okay, interesting. I don't really want a screenshot, to be fair. Let's just keep going. What else is around here? One thing I have to admit is that the soundtrack isn't as annoying as it used to be. If you remember 13 um, original game soundtrack, it was all... And I didn't like that. What was that, then? Wait, what's this? Can I go on the pole? I want to swing on the pole. Seems I can't... Oh, wait, there's a dude here. Okay, let's take it down. Okay, I can take down another niblet. <laughs> <laughs> it's such a cute name, don't you think? I think so. Okay, I've run out of ATB nearly. Okay, should I block here? Going in for the block. Glutton, that's not a very nice kind of ability name, I have to admit. You're a sinner! And what do sinners get? They get punished. Okay, here we go, and out of there. Not really liking that costume, it looks a little weird. I don't know about the trousers. A little bit of revealing, your skirt is a little short. I can see your underpaths. So that's not very awesome. <laughs> <laughs> but minions, go section below, what do you think of this so far? Is the full game out? Have you played it? I know it's out in Japan. I'd love to know if you played it though and if you think it's really awesome. Oh wait a minute, who's that? No, you did it! Point, no. Okay, you've unlocked Schemata Customization. Oh, okay, okay, interesting. So if I press triangle, here we go. Ah, Customize Schematas. So I have, what are these? Oh look, little costumes, and they're all different. Okay. Okay, I don't know about the I don't know about the first two. Red Mage looks a little bit weird. <laughs> what do you think to these ones, minions? Do you think they look a bit cheesy? That one's got a tail, which is kind of okay. So we've got a furry lightning. Okay, dragoon, which I guess oh, it kind of looks like that villain from from thirteen two. Okay, cool. But I kind of like the ones I've got. What's this one about? Right, so strength plus eighty, kind of like a okay. So that one's kind of got more attack damage to it then, but what about Dragoon? Dragoon! Dragoon- oh wait, oh I see, so this little sword, mage, some- oh, okay, cool. Right, so if I take away the Dark Muse and replace it with Dragoon, 520 attack. Okay, so Dragoon's actually better than that. So if I pick this, how do I- how do I switch it? I kind of want to change it. I can delete them too, is that good or bad? Do I want to de delete it? Can I just remove it? Wait a minute, switch. And I'd like to switch it with this one. There we go, minions. Now we have Dragoon. Cool. More attack damage too, which is awesome. Seems it's more powerful than the Savior ability, which is kind of unusual. So is the Savior one kind of just like a average, like, I don't know, like for all different kind of situations kind of a thing? Maybe. Okay, let's continue onwards. Her, her clothes are a little bit scantily, don't you think? What is it wearing these kind of weird 
chafing looking... Like, look! You can actually see her thighs! That is really unusual. I think we're going this way, though. Can't let that distract us! Let's just keep going. Okay, we're going this way, I think, minions. So you can find some more stuff. Who is she? Who am I? That dude's wearing pajamas! Appears at last. Is the savior a sign of coming destruction? Or a promise of hope? I would like to bet on hope. If you believe you are the true savior, you'll need to be carefully prepared for the battles that await you on your journey. You creep me out! What's this all about? Okay, Primer. So the Primer is basically like the information nexus, I guess you could say. General stores buying recovery. So this guy can... Oh, okay. Okay, so we can go buy some shizzle off this guy. Awesome. What can I buy from you? So, I could buy some potions, maybe. Try buy some potions? Restores a small part of HP in, uh, in Frost Potion. Oh, okay, so you can restore HP and also put some kind of freezing element onto your attacks. That's cool. Okay, so the items actually have kind of extra attributes. So you can cast Protect and Shell. I remember all those from the old Final Fantasies. Okay, cool. Cool, can I, can I buy some more of these? I've got loads of monies. I'm going to buy some more of these potions. Oh, so you can only have up to six items. That's kind of weird. Why can I only have six items? Why can't I have loads and just collect as many as I want? Hmm... Interesting, interesting indeed. It seems that like the game revolves around some kind of timer thing too. Kind of like Dead Rising maybe? That's really like going out there in the comparing of video games. But I think you got, as it says, you got six days. You got to try and do as much stuff as possible within those six days then? Oh dear. Oh look, it's Frost! Oh, Snow! Help me track him. <laughs> His name mixed up, then I'm so sorry means, as I said, not the biggest fan of the 13 games, I guess you could say. Where's how oh, he's gone this way? Okay. It's kind of unusual because I thought Snow was a good guy, so it seems he's now become some kind of pimp. <laughs> a bad guy pimp? I don't know. Where's he gone though? I want to fight him and kick his butt. He was kind of cool though. I liked his little ice weapon that he was using. Wasn't he more like a melee based dude, so he liked to use his fists and things? It seems that he's changed up now to some kind of axe staff. Where's he going? I don't know. You. You tell me. Okay, going for a fight. I'm really sorry there, Hope, but I must stop your annoying voice. I hated Hope back in the day. He was really annoying. He was really emo. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, I'm getting attacked from all different directions. You see his blists here. Oh, block again. Oh, dear. Got hit in the face there, which was not very good. Right, ran out of ATB there. Let's try Dragoon out. Blocking. Wait a minute. Oh, look. Oh, cool. She can do counter attacks and stuff. Ooh, stabity stab. That was cool. Okay, he's kind of down now. So, Dragoon is all about singular, more focus attacks. Okay, going for the rapid fire now, using my major ability. Blocking! Block! Oh, he's dead! Judgment oh! Has been delivered. Judgment has been delivered. <laughs> okay, cool. So, it seems that you can use a counter attack with the Dragoon ability, uh, or the costume, and that way you can actually take down dudes in one hit. That's kind of cool, I like that. Might need to focus on that Dragoon ability a little bit more. Running straight into the chaos? <laughs> no freaking clue what you're talking about, but it's pretty awesome either way. So the chaos thing, is that a running theme with the... Shut up a second! You'll have to ask him yourself. Now hurry. Wait, 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 wait. So this whole chaos thing, is that to do with the whole Dissidia games and stuff? It seems like chaos it has like a, a capital C onto it, like it's an actual person. So I think that's kind of what it's about. So maybe this whole like chaos thing is actually like a Satan creature from the like Dissidia games. Is that right, minions? That'd be kind of cool if it all connects, though. Okay, keep going. What was the other one called? There was Chaos and there was another one. I can't remember what the other one was called. Hey, that's Snow! Wait for me, buddy. Oh dear, that thing's gonna try and hit me, I think. Smacking it! It's got 10% less health. Okay. So maybe we should go into Dragoon ability. And then go for a beatdown. Should we go for a beatdown, minions? Here we go. Oh wait, counter! There we go! Oh, cool! Uses a lot of ATV though, I mean, he's got to remember that. Keep smacking him though. I'm liking this, it's kind of fun. I'm liking that it's letting me actually do the combat. I remember in 13, the first game, it would not let you do the stuff. You could manually do it, but it was kind of like fighting against the system. It wanted you to kind of use its auto battling and then just switch between the different roles and stuff, which was really annoying. I did not like that. But in this one, you can actually like use your abilities and stuff, which is kind of cool. I like this. It's going back to how Final Fantasy was with picking your abilities and using them manually. Anything around here? Maybe some hidden stuff? Seems not. How do I jump up this thing? Can I jump? Okay, square does not allow you to jump. How do you jump? Press circle. Okay, there we go. Okay, cool. Oh, she has a limited jump feature then. What? I have no clue what you're talking about. I don't see it. Sure, he liked to look after people, but lording it over an entire city? Well, it wasn't his choice. 
He started out just trying to help everyone, and eventually, he became ruler by popular acclaim. Although I'm not so sure he actually rules anything anymore. He doesn't do much these days except preside over the nightly revelry. Lord of the Feast Hall. Doesn't look like he's enjoying it much, though. When I looked into his eyes, I didn't see much of the old snow. Hmm, interesting. Okay, cool. So he basically is like a pimp then. Primitive Strike! Ooh, they're a great one too. I assume that's from smacking him in the back of the head. Okay, he's got barely any health this time. Hi there, dude. I'm gonna have to pwn you now, if you don't mind. Oh, going in for the guard. There we go. Going for attack. Nice little bit of a combo. And then, if we go for a beatdown. Oh, jump strike. That's an awesome little finisher there. Hi there, dude. You're nearly dead. Charge attack. Oh, we can actually put all your ATB into the strike. Ooh, uppercut finisher. That was awesome. Okay, cool. So I can see maybe the Dragoon costume being really powerful and very useful about doing more focused attacks, as we said originally. Okay, awesome. Okay, let's move onwards and see what happens next. Okay, we've got... How much time do I have? I've got six days left, it seems. So, it kind of follows a normal everyday clock, which is kind of unusual, or is that minutes? So does that mean the game is very short? If there's only... Did she say 13 days or something until the end of the... Eh, there's snow, look. Okay, he's just running away like the coward he is. Oh, there's another dude down there. Oh dear, did he see me? I think he might have seen me. So can I- Oh! Watch out! Okay, can I jump on him and then preemptive strike him? Nope! <laughs> okay, there we go, 10% less HP for this battle. Let's give this one a go. So if we go into this, and then do a counter blow and he attacks me, go for it, brood. You, you, you get the first strike. And then- Oh, there we go. That was cool. Going in for the charge, I'm using all of my ATB as much as possible, and then going in for the strike! He is down! Wow, he did not like that. Out of ATB though, so going back into savior mode. Here we go. Bit of a thunder strike. Going in for the block! There we go, and then smack him! As much damage as possible! There we go, nice bit of a combo. Going back into Dragoon. Still have a charge. Come on, as much as possible! Why don't you try that Lancet actually yeah, in a minute? Oh, there we go, he did not like that. Counter block! Oh, I got no ATB left. I see, I see. Let's give Lancet a go. I wanna see what this is like. Okay, just poke him! <laughs> Easy said than done. What is going on with your costume? Why are your pants showing? That is, that's just despicable. Back in the day, back in the 16th century, if people saw you like that, you'd lose your head. Literally, you would be executed. Right. Got it. But now it's just acceptable. Okay, let's just keep moving. So we are now going up here, I think. Oh, I got climb this. Okay. Right. Got loads of these dancing poles. It seems that Snow likes to quit. Um, equip his nightclubs with pole dancing people. <laughs> right, let's go over here and see where he's gone. This demo's quite long, I have to admit. Kind of cool. I like it when demos have a bit of length to them, a bit of flesh, a bit of meatiness. Okay, we've got more enemies to pwn. Wait, 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 wait. One thing I might actually do first is maybe heal. So press triangle. Here we go. Recovery items. So I'm thinking we use an X potion. There we go. Awesome. Back to full health. Back to dish out some more pwnage. But you can use that in the battles themselves too, so you can actually heal yourself in battle if you need to. But at the same time, I assume you can actually get like a healing costume too, maybe more like a medic. Hi there, little bunny yip! I'm gonna call you a bunny yip, because you look like a bunny yip. Okay, time to bring on the ponage again. Right, going into Dragoon. I like the Dragoon ability. Right, charge attack. Here we go, before it tries to attack me itself. And... Pwn! And I missed. Whoops. Okay, I might need to block here. It's coming for me, minions. Blocking! Quick, before I run out of all my ATV. Can we use a Blizzaga? Oh, it did not like magic. Ooh, interesting. So maybe the little niblets don't like mage powers? Okay, cool. Need to remember that. But then the Dragoon ability just outdoes everything anyway. I'll look around. Uh, we, we know that you're already out looking around. I thought that was the original goal anyway. Snow? Snow, what, what's this? Examine. Ooh. Okay, kind of out of the way. Oh, it's a little, ah, uh, it's an interface to open the gate. I see, okay. Source of the chaos is in the middle of the palace, right? Oh wait, 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 wait! Enough chat chat for now. Wait, wait, wait! So how come I was able to take that dude down without fighting him one on one? That was a little confusing. Was anyone else confused? Wait, look! It's that girl who looks like Sarah. Hi there. Loading the possibilities of awesome. 
<laughs> okay, you're kind of creeping me out. What the? Who are you? And what are you doing here? If you're playing around in the middle of this chaos, I'm guessing you're not human. <laughs> You can see when you're inside this stuff? Hmm. Then you can't be one of God's regular lackeys, can you? Oh, that's just racist. I think that's the only thing I can really do, Hope. Jeez. <laughs> Great, I got fire dragon. Okay, here we go. Staggering tutorial. Oh, I remember this from the original one. So if you use your weaknesses, your uh, advantages against its weaknesses, you can stagger it and then do loads of combos because it's kind of like being stunned. What's overclock? Let's take the tutorial anyway. Okay. Try to put foes repeatedly in their weak points for massive damage. <laughs> or in the opening that appears between attacks. Give them no respite and you will eventually stagger them. Staggered foes become very vulnerable. Okay. The monster you see here is Altis. Is that how you call, call him that name? I don't know. Which is vulnerable to magic. Attack it with magic abilities such as Thunder. Press R2 to use the Libra. Oh, okay, so you've got the scanning ability too as well. Okay, maybe we should do that. Okay, Libra. So, it seems that we know nothing. So I think you're supposed to hit it with its weak point, like its weak nusses, and that way you can unlock more Libra? Libra, Libra. Or is it that you have to kill it to get the Libra, Libra? I don't know. Okay, Thunder. Taste some Thunderage. Yeah, you didn't like that, did you? There we go. Ooh, blaze burst. Now what happens? When you attack a monster's weakness, its HP gauge responds with a stagger wave. As you deliver effective attacks, the wave grows, and eventually the gauge turns red, showing that the foe is nearly staggered. When you first encounter a new enemy, experiment with different attacks to find its vulnerabilities and attacks that best exploit them. Okay. Right. Now what happens? He's gonna hurt me, isn't he? Might wanna block. Ow. Okay, that kind of hurt. Wait a minute, do I have any better thundery attacks? Seems not. So, I got no ATB either. <laughs> I guess try some Blizzaga on it. What do you think of Blizzaga, buddy? Seems that you don't really care for Blizzaga. Oh uh, no, quick freeze. Okay, let's press R2 again. Um. So, he is weak against ice, it seems, which is really, really awesome, but the game said that he was weak against thunder. But it's only a normal, so it's kind of like average attack damage then. But if we use the blizzard attacks, then we should be fine, minions. Blizzardering again. Yeah, you didn't like that, did you? Oh, wait a minute, block. Ooh, that kind of hurt. I have to admit. Okay, it's going for a normal attack combo. Yeah! There we go, awesome. And then... Wait, 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 wait. What if we try using a counter blow on it? Go on, try and attack me. I dare you. You're really big. I know you do. Ooh. Oh, we have to hold it. Oh, dear, I see. So you don't just wait and take it in the face. Okay, going for the charge attack. Let's use all that ATB to pony in the face, minions. And... Ooh, you did not like that. 2,000 plus damage. Awesome. Okay, here we go. Doing some more blizzagering. Okay, I'm liking this. I'm liking the whole combo thing. Lots and lots of magic. I don't know if I've staggered it, though. Does it look staggered? I'm not entirely sure. Going in for some more thundering. There we go. Thunder does barely anything to it, which is a massive shame. Okay, let's try doing the counter blow again, but this time we'll wait for it to actually attack. Block it! There we go! <gasps> it staggered it! There we go, you staggered the foe! When the st you stagger a foe, you not only inflict heavy damage, but you also grant yourself the opportunity to unleash further attacks. The best way to defeat your foes is to stagger them first. Okay, Dragoon, you are showing some real awesome advantages over my foes. Okay, cool. And now we just beat down on its ass, right? Okay, what if I use Overclock? Here's Overclock minions. What's this doing? Oh, there we go. Ah. Oh, I get to use unlimited ATB then. Okay, cool. Interesting. Okay, I just did this. <laughs> just did the Overclock. You want me to do it again? So maybe I did it to the right time so now I can take advantage of this demo's kind of tutorial system. L2 unleashes Lightning's powerful Overclock ability. When Overclock is activated, time seems to slow to a crawl for everyone except Lightning herself. This leaves enemies defenseless against her seemingly instantaneous. That is a massive paragraph flurry of attacks. Use Overclock now. I'm, I'm pressing it, but it's, nothing's happening. Here we go. And now, if you use Overclock while foes are staggered, you will be able to deal loads of heavy damage. Overclock consumes EP, but in return it can be used at any time. How do you build AP up? Is that through just like killing loads of dudes? Maybe. Okay, here we go. 
Should we go for a blitz? Wait, 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 maybe we go for only these. Oh, wait, no, 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 count a blow. No, 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 I pressed the wrong button. Yeah. There we go. Land set. Yes. Yes, you don't like Dragoon, do you? Maybe that's why it's called Dragoon like a Dragon Hunter. Do you think that's what it is? I think maybe that's what it is. Okay, what are you going to do now, friend? I think he's going to go for attack minions. Okay, going for the block. Go on, buddy. Bring me your ball. There we go. Yeah, not much damage there. Not much damage there means. Halfway down on the damage, though, which is awesome. Okay. Might need to try and do a counter blow here. Do you want to try and do a counter blow on me? Come on, let me do the counter blow. You know you want to. Go on. Go on, you're so cute. Look at you with your long little hair. You kind of like Phoebe Buffet from Friends, but Dragon. Can I... Can I use the counter blow on you? Is that all you there we go. Yeah. Oh, and it invades him too. That was cool. Okay, interesting. Wait a minute. Might be able to use this to my advantage. So now if I go back into counter blow... Yes! You think you can Wait a minute, I did it at the wrong time, didn't I? Gah. Okay, that kind of hurt. So you need to use it at the last possible second, minions. Let's use one of these health items. There we go. Can, I, can you use the health item, please? Thank you. Right! Uh, I need to use some Blazaga, don't I? It doesn't like ice attacks from what I remember. Just keep smacking it around with those ice attacks, minions. Okay, what else have we got here? What else can I use? How do you actually make it staggered, though? Because it doesn't seem like... Wait a minute. Oh dear, counter blow. Yes! That was awesome. You did not like that, did you? You did not like that indeed. Okay, wait a second. Wait a minute. Check in for the charge. Let's use all the rest of my AP up. And then... Oh, wait, wait, wait. I've got even more awesome idea. Well, you did the jump. And then you end up doing the normal attacks. That might be quite cool. Okay, got my counter blow ready. And... Counter blow. That didn't work. <laughs> okay, why didn't it work that time, minions? Maybe it has like a chance to it? I don't know. Okay, doing some more Blizzard on it. We have nearly taken this dude down though, which is awesome. Okay, there we go. Or maybe... Wait a minute, now that's flying in the... No, no, that doesn't seem to be right. So, if we now use Charge Attack... Here we go. Going in for a really massive ATB smack here, minions, and... That didn't work! Oh dear, that kind of hurt. Okay, I need to try and understand this whole preemptive... Wait, 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 this whole counter blow preemptive strike thing, because it seems not to be working at times. Okay, come here, buddy. Let's just try and just give this a go again. So if you attack me, I'm going to initiate my counter blow. Here we go. Did I... Ooh. No, that didn't work again. Do you have to do it literally as it attacks you? I think so. Okay, let's do some more blizzagering. And if we go for a normal attack while it's in the air... Yeah. That's awesome. Okay, then we go back for a counter blow again. Come on, dude. I'm gonna slap you a little bit. Oh! There we go! Ah! Yes, you need to do it right as it attacks minions. Okay. We're getting this. We're getting the hang of it. <laughs> Alright, let's smack it in the air. Do some little bit of combo, I guess. What are you gonna do? Wait a minute. He looks like he's gonna do some Bruce. Yep, yep. I thought so. And counter! Nope, that didn't work. Ow, that kinda hurt. I'm losing all of my health minions. This is not good. Okay, respawn. Right, so if we use this item, the Holy Water restores a small amount of HP, but also casts Protect and Shell, which I think will be really useful. Okay, let's do that as quick as possible. There we go. Awesome. So now I should be able to take less damage. Nearly killed it, though, minions, which is really good. But we should be able to fend off one of its final attacks, which should be really, really useful. Going in for a Blitz. Did that do anything? I don't know. Wait a minute, what are you going to do? It's going for a Stampede. There we go! Awesome! Ah, oh, awesome. So maybe the counter blow only works against melee attacks and not ranged attacks. I'm thinking that might be what it is. Because obviously you need to be like right in their face when you actually use that counter blow anyway. Oh uh, no. Going for a guard. Blocking! Ooh, that was close. Okay, cool. Right, let's finish off minions. Oh, it's nearly dead! And it's out of there, minions. Victory to me. What did you think of that fight? That was pretty cool, I have to admit. Yep, looking like a boss. <laughs> I assume I got loads of os. Oh, my rain sucked. Oh, that, that's kind of bad. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> I assume that fight was supposed to end a lot faster than I was doing it. I'm really sorry, minions. I'm new to this game. I'm trying to learn everything for you. Oh dear. Okay, you are now able to encounter Zaltius on the field, but. Why well, would I want to fight him again when I've already done it? By defeating Zaltius, you've been given a battle score, which really sucked. The faster you defeat the beast, the higher your score. Activate Outer World Services and submit your battle score to Facebook. Why well, do I want to do that? Is it... 
Okay. The demo will come to an end at 6 a.m. Keep your eye out on the clock. Listen, Hope. I need more info. Can you analyze this chaos matter for me? I've been trying to do just that, but it's no good. None of my instruments will tell me anything. It's just too hard to see. What do you mean? I'm not sure. The sensors know it's there, all right. But when they actually look into it, they can't pick up anything at all. Sometimes it's so thin. Wait, 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 wait. I got a cutscene here, friend. Really sorry. It's locked. Can I force it? That might be beyond even you. Hold on a second. I'll see what I can do from here. <gasps> hmm. There's a lot of chaos building up back there. Yes, indeed. And snow's inside, or whatever's left of him. Well, he has been living without hope for centuries. Now the world's about to end. He might have lost his mind entirely. If it were anyone else, I'd say that was a given. Do you think it could have gotten to him, though? Broken even his spirit? I hope not, but... After coming all this way? I'm his last chance, damn it. I know what he's going through. The pain of losing Sarah. That's true. If there's anything left of Snow, as the savior, you're the only one who can rescue him. That's why you have to protect yourself. If you're killed, it really will mean the end of the world. And then who can you save? All right, fine. Take me back to the Ark. Hold on. It's the what? Okay, we've got teleportation abilities, it seems. That was so a lot of help. understand his pain? She thinks she's going to save his soul? Would you listen to this nonsense? Ugh, God turns her into the savior and it all goes straight to her head. <laughs> she's a little evil and creepy, don't you think? <laughs> In a cute way. Ooh, the end of a saga. The end of the world. Oh dear, it's coming, it seems as well. Oh boy, that is a lot of dudes. Ooh. Okay, loads of different environments and they're all opened up as well. Yes, open worlds, we love those. You can fight goat man, you can fight big fat demon man, you can fight dra dragon man, you can fight Egyptian things. You can even fight bog monsters, skeleton things. You can stab things. They'll die. There's characters that we didn't like. You've got loads of costumes. Oh dear. <laughs> New characters, which is a given. Oh, not him. Okay, great. Ah, okay, so the original cast are back in it. Oh no, it's Aladdin. Watch out for Aladdin. With only 13 days left, can hope for on life. lightning and everyone I save the world. This is your last chance for payback. Payback to what? Oh wow. It's like... It's like a Batman movie. Lightning Returns, Final Fantasy XIV. Ooh, look, it's the pre-order costume you get to play as Cloud Strike. Kind of. <laughs> but why would you pre-order it just for that? Well, I guess if you're really into Final Fantasy. Okay. Okay, cool. Minions, what do you think to that? Nice little demo, I guess. But what about the arc thing? Is that it then? They said I had it until 6am. So maybe I played the game a lot shorter than I expected. So really, I ended that like, massive boss battle with the zip thing a lot faster. Maybe, do you think? Maybe the game was punishing me because I didn't take as much time with the demo. I have no freaking clue, but still means I hope you enjoyed this little taste of Lightning Returns Final Fantasy XIII. It was very cool. I liked the combat system. It was a lot better than the originals, I have to admit. I hated the auto battle system. It sucked. It was really offensive to me as a gamer in a way because obviously you want to take part in these things and use your mind in these tactical battles of ponage, but it won't let you do that. But now you can in Final Fantasy Lightning Returns, which is really cool. But minions, 
comment section below, tell me what you think of this demo, have you played the game, what did you think to it, I'd love to know, are you excited for this game, have you lost all hope for Final Fantasy in general? Though I have to admit, the new one that's coming out beyond this looks really cool, I think Final Fantasy XV, definitely gonna give that game a go, it looks really awesome, cannot wait. But either way, minions, I will see you guys, girls, minions next time. Remember to join either way if you're not supposed to giveaways, and definitely check out the Proxy Series page for more giveaways, competitions, and just awesome, awesome updates. And I will see you guys, girls, and minions, as I said. Ciao.